You can't see it right now, but my mouth is watering. I'm not gonna show you, CDC guidelines. What is up you guys? Welcome back to On The Go With Jay. Today we're in Kendall, Miami, and we're gonna step inside a Poke Bowl. South Florida is at it again with another hot spot that offers traditional poke with Peruvian ceviche combined with Japanese and Hawaiian poke, bringing together the finest seafood delicacies of both cultures. Sorry, Nemo. They also serve dessert like the Peruvian alfajor, baked chocolate chip banana cake, and famously showcased on Shark Tank, Maven's Creamery Macaroons. I used to live in Hawaii for years and I love how fresh their food was. And when I came to Miami, I realized Miami didn't have a lot of places to eat poke. Both owners, Alma and Walter, who you see behind me, decided it was time for Miami to experience these flavors. All right, so now it's time for the fun part. I get to go behind the counter and see how they make their poke bowls. We are starting off with our base of brown rice, some mixed greens, and our three choices of protein. I picked the ahi tuna, salmon, and hamachi yellowtail. Now some veggies to kick off the marinating with some mild sauce because I can't really handle the spice. I'm a crier. You can't see it right now, but my mouth is watering. I'm not gonna show you, CDC guidelines. Next are the toppings. We have choices like crab meat, edamame, seaweed salad, and masago eggs. He wants to be on camera, so I'm gonna put him on. Oh! <laughs> we could top it off with eel sauce, hokey spicy sauce, miso, acevichada sauce is also an option here. Don't judge me, I know it's five o'clock somewhere. I'm gonna try their boba beer, okay? And things are gonna get a bit crazy in here. <laughs> the owner, Walter, made this special for me. I chose the mango flavor for my boba beer mixed with Modelo Especial. I can't promise I won't be buzzed after this. Gracias. Thank you, Walter Alma, so much for this. Beautiful, beautiful prep. I'm so excited. My first thoughts on the boba beer, it tastes like a flavored sparkling cocktail. The ceviche bowl is more than I expected. The Peruvian flavors are making an appearance. They are screaming hello. The plantain chips were a major plus because it pairs perfectly with every bite. Now the poke bowl. Wow, surprisingly the flavors weren't overpowering each other. I could taste every individual topping and fish. I've never had a Peruvian alfajor. This was great and this was also not too sweet, but sweet enough. The next time you're in Kendall, Miami, you absolutely have to check out Poke Bowl. Jay approved. Holy moly. Like, comment, and send this to a friend. And don't forget, every day is an opportunity to share a story.